Welcome to the 32 Power Cup 2023. He's back and better than never. I can feel my heart rate of Dirty weather, lightning, thunder, pouring weather. Accomplished to me. I promise the darkness, I can honest believe. But don't cross me, I might lose control over the lost beast. So you lost the way inside with the key control by fight or flight. And this world ain't right, won't accept it. Negative energy, I expect it. Once it's in your mind, it's infectious. So fight for your life and reject it. You better give me space, I'm protective. My adrenaline spikes when I'm threatened. Oh, fuck it, Peter! Oh, man! 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 Oh, f
is Hounslow and listening to a Victor's with the goalkeeper being the star of the show. Keeping two pens. Two, 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 just those two pens that you say, like, talk us through it. Um, funny thing, yeah. The cafe is really good. Remember? Yeah. So the little one.
Straight away. Straight away.
The cup's going know, back to somewhere in North, either North or Northwest again. Northwest Champions League final. Here, yeah, right here.
Footballer TV. I'm with the winner, the witness, Islington Borough. You're the skipper as well, goalkeeper. Three penalty shootouts. How many saves? What, six, seven? Talk me through this, this, this one because you actually missed the penalty and then you had to, like, you missed the penalty and then you guys to save the I think, I think when it comes to penalties, it's all about mindset, isn't it? Yeah. So it's like, before we went, um, the penalty started, I told the boys that it's, it's, it's all in the head, isn't it? If you're going to pick one side, you're just going to change, isn't it? But for me, I didn't, I didn't take my own words, didn't I? Really. <laughs> I didn't take my own words. But uh, I, don't, I don't have much to say, but I'm really happy for it. Like, what's happened, isn't it? Good praise and thanks to God. Amen to that. That was brilliant, because after missing that penalty, yeah. like, I was sitting there and I was thinking, I was going to go to your head then, you're going to be able to save another penalty. It's just, hey, I'm going to ask Yeah. No, no, I like that. Where, where's your manager? I said! Where's the manager? I said, so, hey! Because your manager... Leo! Where's Cesar? So? Because he did say you were going to win it at the start. I don't know why you were there, right? Hey, listen, I promise you, yeah. You're, you're not going to believe me now, but I'm going to have to pay for my team. Please, if you're going to have to Yeah. Well, we're going to have to pay for my listen, well done, man. The player of the tournament. Hey, thank you. Yeah. Oh, 
champions go to the borough of Richmond. One by one, Captain Lars, one by one, Captain Lars, let's go, let's go. I don't know, I don't know what you guys are working on today. There's one left, there's another coach. There's one left here. Yeah. Alright, here we go again, here we go. Hey, hey, hey. Hello, 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 hello. I have got my phone for someone who's sending us, 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 Two time, hey Bobby, don't forget two time winners. Two time. And again, guys. Two time. Every single year. I run this. I hope one day a team from East London and South London will win it. But again, in 2019. It went to New Zealand, it went to Enfield. We get Enfield. In 2021, it went to Islington for the first times. time. In 2022, it remained in Barnet. And now, for the first time ever, a team has won it twice. Two times. And it's gone back again. Two times.
Two times. Two times. Two turns. No, stand up. Alright, three, two, one, alpha. Shut up. No, no, alright, three, two, one, connect, yeah? Three, two, one, connect! One more, one more, one more, three, two, one, connect! Footballer TV, I'm here with the 2023 32 Borough Cup winners, two times me. I was about to say two times. Check. What was it? Um, two chains. Yeah, two chains. First time was so nice, we had to do it twice. Okay, so you won this tournament with a 14 and 15 year old. As you're saying, let me let me let me let me just explain. The, the, let me just explain. The first time we won it yeah, was 2021. This man to the left of me was the goalkeeper. Wow. He was a he, he's a goalie. He's the youngest in charge. He's, 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 he's not even how old is he now? He's not even 20 yet. He's the, he's, the, he's the youngest in charge. So even though we had youngsters on the pitch, he's a young coach, but he's he's, he's up and coming. I think he's gonna go very far. So did you give your goalkeeper a lot of advice because he had he, he wants to start the show. Three penalty competitions, about seven or eight penalty saves. I feel like he's very calm. I spoke to him before, but I told him to play his game. Yeah, that's what he showed me. Too, so, I so, with this group of players, like where, where do you go after this? Or where are you going? <laughs> Obviously, we'll be back next year. As you said, we've got a young team, so a lot of these boys can play again next year. So next year, we'll be back to defend it. Um, but Stairs and Lippin, if they have to apply themselves, there's no, there's, there's no ceiling for them. They can go as far. Uh, I don't know if you saw from the promo, all the boys from the year, we're going to have them back on there. They're like professional clubs. So oh, wow, that's, that's brilliant. And that, that, that is the aim. The aim is to prep them, get them where I'm right, and push them on the road. So during, let's say, term time, for example, do you like train? Do they train with you guys, or is it just come together for this um, competition? Um, some of us are from our academy in Seattle, and some are from Connecticut as well. Okay. So yeah, we pull both squads together. And yeah. Just, so teamwork made the dream work. And, and you know what, like, the, 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 bigger, the bigger picture is that obviously we work for Kinetic Foundation, like the college program. Yeah. But I think across a lot of teams, there are a lot of Kinetic um, scholars around. So oh, wow. We, we're based in lots of schools in London. So yeah, man. But I, I, you know what, I have to give credit to Brent because I think their plan penalties is, 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 is tough to lose a game on penalties, let alone a final. And they applied themselves so well. Let's go back six hours, or was it seven hours? I don't know. I came, I came over to you and I said, what can we expect from you? And you said to me, you're going to win it. And I said to you, yeah, 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 the joke. You were like, no, we're going to win it. And, 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 and you won it. And just tell the people at home, give, give three reasons or three words why you won it today and you were so confident. My players were hung hungry, innit? Hungry. Hungry, we had passion. Passion. And we didn't give up. And they didn't give up. Uh, that's why I say I'm very happy with my team. With the wins. This is why we here now. Cool. Well done, and hopefully see you guys next year. Well done. Big footballer TV. Do you guys remember Paul from the beginning? Manager of Richmond. When everyone was hired, you know, he was like, no, I'm, I'm the manager. They won the Europa League um, penalty shootout. Yes. Talk me through the penalty shootout. I didn't see all of it, but I heard, like, it went back and forth. Back it went forth. back and forth. So, both teams took good three pens, and then when they got to the fourth pen for each team, one missed, the second one missed, and then you keep going, keep going. And then had one that missed um, on the other team. Yeah. Sam, our goalkeeper, is yeah. gonna take it. Hits the crossbar. Oh, was that the yeah. one? All I heard was I didn't see it. I just heard smack. Yeah. And then I saw the ball traveling yeah. towards the halfway. So our back. keeper was gonna take it. If, if keeper scored, we would have won. But then he got his guns back on, winning goal, saved the pen, and then our young captain Edgar yeah. took the pen as well, scored. 
Okay, so I, I look at you and I'm, I'm, I'm assuming that you're young. Yes, 19. 19. So you could have maybe potentially yeah. played in the tournament yourself. And you've brought together a team that's just won something. How did you do that, considering like they're your peers as well? So. Well, first and foremost, it's not just me. It's Ali, Ali Gara, White Star Academy. Um, I'm a player called Sam. And I've, I've coached a lot of these lot. Okay. Some of these lot I've known from because I, I coach for White Star. So okay. Some of these lot I've, I've brought up. So to get the team together was just good. And then I did better players, better Ruby and Colin players as well to make it as well. Okay, so do you play yourself? I do. Centre back? Yeah, centre back, CDM. Anyway. A lot of people have been saying CDM. No, I'm, I'm actually a CDM. Okay. But if someone told me to do a job at centre back, I'm going to do my job. Big Footballer UK at Hackney Marshes. We've just covered the 32 Borough Cup, um, which brings young males together from the 32 different boroughs. Um, I'd like to big up Bobby, it's been an amazing event. Big up all 32 boroughs. Um, shout out to the Champions League winners, Islington, that said that they would do it at the start. But overall, it's been such a great um, experience and great tournament and yeah i can't wait to come back here next year but until then guys until our next video um it's hunger never give up and i can't remember the third one um, but yeah roll safe